Kim Lymphatic here. All massage affects the lymphatic system. All massage affects the lymphatic system. However, to be a true lymphatic massage, the massage must be very, very light. The lymphatic system is right underneath the skin. And then the muscle is right underneath the lymphatic system. So if you are getting a very aggressive lymphatic massage, most likely you've just had plastic surgery and the physician didn't want to do a drain. So he found some people to say they're lymphatic massage therapists and then they just push the fluid as hard as they can through drain holes or yeah, the holes that a drain would normally go in. That's not a lymphatic massage. That's not what I consider a lymphatic massage. That is affecting the lymphatic fluid. However, and then also a cellulite massage where they take these rollers and they roll as hard as they can. Yeah, that affects the fascia and the cellulite. You're smushing the lymphatic system. So they'll call it a lymphatic massage, but it's not truly a lymphatic massage. A lymphatic massage is very, very light going in very specific directions for what you need. So for example, if you have a lymphatic cellulite massage, you'll get beaten up because it's affecting the fascia, which is underneath the lymphatic system. But the lymphatic system will be affected because you can't like push on the skin without affecting the lymphatic system. What do I want to say now? Oh yeah, so if you do get one of those really rough lymphatic massages after plastic surgery, let's say a BBL, then you want to come to a massage therapist such as myself who is trained in the very light technique. Because once you've squished the lymphatic system, once you've lipoed the lymphatic system, once you've just terrorized the lymphatic system with surgery, you need to teach your lymphatic system how to work again. And that's why you go to someone like me.